Scrapbooking.com Magazine presents the following Basic Techniques article from the November 2012 issue. Square One, Cards and Gifts by author and artist Judy Kaufman. This is the time of year when holiday card making and shopping kick into high gear. So this installment of Square One includes some of both. Easy and elegant cards come first, followed by a gift idealist. First the cards. Each of these sparkly cards starts with an embossing folder and a piece of shimmer sheets. None took more than 10 minutes. By using the Perfect Layers and Perfect Squares tools, cutting and layering the cardstock components is a snap. It takes only seconds to do the embossing or position each sticker, and about a minute to layer a cardstock border. Embossing folders come in many styles and they're available at every craft store I've ever visited, as well as online. I included some that were not originally designed for holidays, but gave me the effect that I wanted. See if you can figure out which ones. There are over three dozen samples for inspiration. Colors range from rich and sophisticated to bright pink and chartreuse. Something for every taste. The size of your folder and your decision about whether to use the entire embossed piece or cut it down into smaller sections will determine the size and proportions of your cards. Samples shown include 6 inch square, A2 half sheet, and 5 by 7 rectangles as well as a variety of other sizes. The first step is to emboss a rectangular piece of gemstones, iridescent iris, or metallic shimmer sheets. One piece of shimmer sheets measures 5 by 12 inches and will make three 4 by 5 card fronts. More with smaller pieces, fewer with larger ones. Next, lightly sand the raised areas of the embossed surface. Wipe off with a soft rag to remove the dust. If you like lots of sparkle, skip the sanding and go directly to step 4. Gemstones Shimmer Sheets has a dramatic silver core that's revealed when sanded. Sanded iris colors, except for black, reveal a white core. Black iris reveals a muted gray, while sanded metallic colors have a clear core. Three very different results. Step 3. For more color and to further change the way the shimmer sheets catches the light, Alter the shimmer sheets with stays-on inks after you emboss it or with alcohol inks before you emboss and sand it. Step 4. Adhere the embossed rectangle to a folded card base using double-sided tape. Nothing more is needed, but you can embellish as much as you want. For additional design options, add a peel-off greeting or rubber stamp a greeting. Embellish with glitter dots, glitter lines, metallic borders, or other peel-offs. Add ribbon, cord, charms, brad, resin shapes, die cuts, or other low-relief items. Dimensional stickers are a great focal point. And branch out. Use the same technique to make gift tags, flat or dimensional ornaments, party decorations, and cards for other occasions. Lumpy or very thick cards require extra postage, but shimmer sheets is as light as a feather. So if your cards are flat and you use low relief, unbreakable embellishments, they'll only need a standard first class stamp. Now, are you ready to go shopping? Then check out my detailed list of two dozen great gift ideas for your crafty friends and family members, also suitable for serious hint dropping. Just go to the Basic Techniques article on the Scrapbooking.com website. Whether you're shopping for creative friends or for yourself, these items are sure to bring holiday smiles. A printable project card with instructions and a list of supplies can be found by clicking on the step-by-step -step instructions link within the online version of this article. To find the products featured in this article and shown in these layouts, check with your local scrapbook retailer. Browse our premier retail stores for coupons to a store near you. We hope you enjoyed this article. Don't miss the rest of the great articles and features in this month's issue of Scrapbooking.com magazine.